I've had a plan since I was a kid. It's gonna be super weird when like, you know, Pat and Fruits leave. They are not from Jersey! And they're gonna be 3,000 miles away. Long live New York Pop Punk. Are you ready, kids? <laughs> aye, aye, Captain! I can't hear you! Aye, aye, Captain! <laughs> this is it. This is uh, the last leg of the tour. We're driving to San Francisco, and we're gonna play tonight at the Honey Hive. And we get to see Steve Badford again. We're gonna rock out. That's what it is, man. Enjoying the, enjoy the time you got. I can't. One more. Dude, no, get that out of my face. Bruce, we need you to do it. Come I'm on. gonna die. Do this. Put that all in your mouth right now. Do it. Do it. I'm scared. Do it. I hope this doesn't awaken something in me. <laughs> one bite. One bite. One bite. One bite. That's my boy. And now we're gonna see what he's really like. I'm done. So what's your thing with eating? What happens when you eat? Shut the f up. <laughs> Nothing. Why do you get so worked up when you eat? I wish I knew. I just like... I make a really big deal when I eat. If y'all know me, you know I love me some homemade ice cream like it's my craft beer. So, uh, I'm about to go wild in this ice cream place. It's so pretty. <gasps> Excuse our mess. Not at all. It's for the best cause I've ever seen. Thank you. Look at Smash viewing area. Look at that. Look at those layers. I'm about to make it ugly. Okay, check it out. I got frosting. I got cake. I got ice cream. Oh, that is good. The frosting is so good. This place, Small Cakes, is phenomenal. I'm like a big craft ice cream fan, like people are big about craft beer. You had to pick between a lifetime supply of Stewart's or what you got in your hands right now? I gotta, I gotta go Stewart's, you gotta man. Stay loyal, huh? I gotta stay loyal, but I mean, look. Look, uh, if I ended up with a lifetime supply of this, I'm not gonna be a, a complaining man, all right? I'm gonna be a very happy camper. Sick though. We call it the specific ocean, right? Specifically the ocean. <laughs> yeah, all the other oceans aren't aren't specifically. Right. most uncomfortable I've ever been on the West Coast. Mainly, the, the one thing is the Indian cuisine and pizza restaurant over there. That's just, I'm watching, I'm, I'm watching that like a horror film. I keep looking and having to look away. You think they put curry sauce in pizza? I don't know what they do in there and I don't want to find out. Butt heavies. Why do you call them butt heavies? Because it's the opposite of Bud Light, I guess. Look, I know you guys have never heard the term butt heavy, but a lot of people call these butt heavies. <laughs> I could I could find a lot of people that would call them that. <laughs> it's horrible technique. punk rock, you know, I grew up with all Warped Tour and stuff like that. And uh, these are songs that are kind of my angst and motivations. And the music all motivates me, so the truth behind it is all do it yourself, by the way. We're going to EP this, uh, this summer and then uh, do some shows. But overall, man, just the vibes have been great, so loving it.
Nay, 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 Yeah! All right! San Francisco, Tokyo, Drip! This tour has been so easy. 99% great times, 1% stress. Just saw them grooving, and they just looked back and they were grooving, and they just kind of gave me the nod and made the eye contact. Play music again and just get out there and, and kick some ass. Takers Leapers was killer. Watching them kill it every night and their professionalism and approach to the stage oh, was really influential for a side of playing that I never thought about. Hanging out in the opening for us, it means a lot. Right? For real. Last name ever, first name greatest. Boy, ain't nothing to play with. Started out local, but thanks to all the haters, I know G4 pilots on a first name basis. Fucking loser, he ain't even go to class. Bueller. The catchy, melodic stuff very poppy but with that energy and some technicality thrown in. Whenever we get to play San Francisco we always want to play with like touring bands and support those guys so that was really cool that we were asked to do that. Our lyrics are pretty sad, so uh, the songs, if the songs are sound happy, it makes them easier to listen to, I guess. Definitely the best night of the tour on all accounts. Every band killed it. This guy I'm gonna miss this. was I'm gonna miss this so beautiful. You got the bass players, man. The 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 flesh. Honestly, you know, we're over overlooked. I didn't know I could find my shot. All right, guys, so much All right good sir. Okay. Thank you guys for coming. Hug it all. It's not like we we got the first one wrong and we decided to do it again for aesthetic measures for the story. I know. It totally wasn't my crew Not staged at all. Not yeah. staged at all. We don't stage these things. We don't stage these things. We are not from Jersey! You guys mentioned Jersey. No, we did not! Yeah, you guys did. We're not from Jersey. It. It's okay. <laughs> that, I just had a reaction like that. <laughs> Seeing them every day, playing shows with them every day, it's gonna be weird not to see Baki's letting his hair down and doing this kind of deal. <laughs> Let's do the band photo shoot. Let's <laughs> do it. <laughs> Thanks for coming on tour with Atticus Finch and Taker Sleepers. It's been a real pleasure. <laughs> Stop making it hard. Hope you Die, Harley Jarvis. <laughs> you <laughs> Harley <laughs> Jarvis. <laughs> Dude, you gotta watch it. Damn it! This whole thing up. Got him! 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 Got
going to be doing a lot more of these, but I think this is going to be one of the ones that I remember for the longest. Yeah. Yeah. You, you don't, you're not always going to be able to play the biggest venues, and you're not always going to be able to play the smallest <laughs> Die, Harley Jarvis. Sorry. <laughs> I had to do it. I did. Harley, if you're listening to this, I agree with him. That being the point, but... I, I think we're we're all going to remember this and the fact that we've done this with people that we just met but we connected with and we learned to connect with them on a whim. Dude, I'm going to I'll be 67 years old tomorrow. 2 years shy of 69. <laughs> <laughs> remembering this on a rocking chair, dude. Even though the tour was very short, I wish it was still longer, um, but it was, it's was it been a blast. You guys are all very talented musicians, and I would love to and share the stage with you guys again, and I can't wait. Thank you. Yeah, yeah straight up. Uh, this is a short time we get it. Uh, oh. Oh, what is that? That's a Ooh. that's a really cool. It's from shirt. a book. <laughs> it's this little <laughs> part of our time where we have enough resources to make this happen and have fun, have a good time, and we have the freedom to do whatever the f we want with it. That might change, so I'm gonna f always cherish that, so that's fine. Yeah. Hey. 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 Robbie's job is to actually suck this dildo looking thing right there, so. He's gonna edit it Here we all go! It'll pick up the sound perfect. <laughs> but seriously, tell me, thank you for everything. That was, it was thank awesome. You. Yeah. And everything you said right back at you. Kevin. Pleasure's all ours. Not you. Not you. I love you. Get home safe, dude. I'm going to see you on the East Coast. Please, please. 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 Please, Super glad this tour happened. Um, pretty tired, as you can probably see from everybody, but it was a good experience. Cool thing was just jamming with Nick and Taryn. Um, it was really awesome to just like hang out with them and just kind of like become you know such good friends with them just like like that they came in and, and really just like meshed well with the squad and just had everybody around it was, it was cool that was, I think that was the best part I think the weirdest part for me is that people that I met a few days ago like I miss them and will miss them like I've known them for years it's gonna be super weird when like you know Pat and Fruits leave in a couple days and they're gonna be 3,000 miles away it's always great coming back from a tour and being able to say that you learned more than you knew going in. It's good to get back at it. It's my, you know, my first tour in two years uh, since my move to LA, which was a huge experience for me. I've only really toured with like metal bands and heavy groups, so this was a new experience for me to tour with uh, you know a pop punk band where I was playing a four string bass with a pick and laying down the low end. Just able to have fun and jump around. I'm gonna pop this Dewey real quick. You're pop a wheelie. Automated voice messaging system. Deuces. <laughs> Deuces. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Love you. The whole thing was, was sick, it was awesome, really glad we were able to do it. We were able to get out and see most of the state of California just in a couple of days, seeing how I've never, never been out here before, so it's been, a, it's been really cool for me to be able to do it like this. This tour was for everyone who supported us throughout the years, and uh, this tour is for every member of the Atticus Finch family that wasn't here as well. One of the greatest weeks of my life. By far. I was pretty bitter towards music for a while. You just kind of get older and you try new things. And music was one thing that went to the wayside for a while. And uh, I was bitter towards that. 
and it was just really nice to see people just playing music everywhere we went. And it made you realize that something that may seem so hard sometimes when you're isolated into your own life, sometimes you just got to step outside your comfort zone and you'll find what you're looking for. And, uh... We just there is, there is, there is. 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 make something like this happen. It's kind of cool to be at a point in my career to be able to call upon friends that I've met doing what I do to help us get on the road, to call on people in that same way to support us on the road and do so with less strain on us than what most tours would have on, on people, especially in, in like a band as big or as small as ours is. It's cool to see a plan come together, even if it is over a decade late. You know how the Californians do, uh, celebrating the end of the tour on the way back to uh, that double double. Abode. In and out. <laughs> you have way too much footage of me eating. <laughs> Dad's like trolling you. <laughs>